Well, we all know she enjoys a good mimosa with a breakfast every now and then, but this has gone over the line. This is ridiculous. Elisa Ortiz live in Sacramento learning how to make bacon flavored drinks this morning. Mm -hmm. Like Are you kidding me? Yeah. Are you kidding me? Right? Who needs to wait for right? evening 5 o'clock, right? Because <laughs> now we have bacon vodka. So why not have a little why beverage not? in the morning? It is uh, oh, 7.51 in, uh, in Russia right now. <laughs> Oh, so there you go. There you go. It's okay there. Okay, so of course I had to call the mixologist extraordinaire, my go-to guy, Chris Tucker here at L Wine Lounge. And okay, so, and you know why this is so great? He's so perfect for this because even he can make something like this look fantastic. <laughs> definitely a challenge. Yes, definitely a challenge yes. with this. Uh, when, when I sent this to him, I said, can you make something fabulous out of this? And you said... Are you kidding me? What? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so uh, this is uh, apparently, you know, I mean, there's all kinds of different flavors, but bacon, bacon, you have Bacon, heard. definitely most obscure yes. one that I've come across. Okay, so we're going to try it out, right? So yeah. let's go with the breakfast theme. Uh, you made this one because we all know and love the Bloody Mary, but Bloody you add a little bloody, little bacon to it. Yeah, so you have the bacon vodka that's just adding the twist on the classic uh, Bloody Mary. Yeah. Uh, coming oh, into heirloom good. tomato season, they're not quite there just yet, but another mm -hmm. couple weeks will be fantastic. Okay, does it actually smell oh man I smell bacon well, you I also have the bacon <laughs> garnish there to really take it over the top so okay but I love this one the name of this one uh, pigs in a blanket. Pigs in a blanket. <laughs> so mm. the, the vodka is a potato-based uh, distillate. Uh -huh. So it has potato. You have your bacon. Uh -huh. I added eggs, maple syrup. Mm. You have all your breakfast components oh, right yeah. now. Gosh. It's like a breakfast buffet in a martini glass. Yeah. Wow. It's got a, Perfect. a little blanket of foam that you throw in the, a little uh, Captain little Crunch. <laughs> okay. All right. And lastly, we're going to make this one, okay? Yeah, we're going to make this one. Uh, okay. Basically, this is a blackberry bacon buck. Okay. It sounds good. All right. Sure. So yeah. let's, let's start it up. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> so you've got your, your blackberries here. Uh -huh. So this, we're going to add a little bit of uh, citrus infused simple uh -huh. syrup. Uh -huh. A little bit of lemon juice, fresh squeezed lemon juice. Uh -huh. and, and mind you, he came up with these recipes. <laughs> yeah, the, uh, the options online. <laughs> uh, what was one? One with uh, uh, vodka flavored whipped cream, I think, was one of the ingredients. Oh. Can I just smell that real quick? Sure. Yes, okay. please. Can I smell it? Oh, okay. Really? <laughs> you said that your chef smelled this and tasted it, and uh, they, they it got a thumbs down. Let me tell you what this smells like. <laughs> Carl's Jr. Uh -huh. Western Cheeseburger. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Mm. And yeah. some antifreeze. Oh, man. That's, oh. that's probably the most complimentary <laughs> way we could come up with describing the smell. The other options... Uh, <laughs> Other options, you're not going to find your typical uh, food store. Right, right. Maybe with uh, with pet goods. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we got the berries, we got the lemon juice. Yeah, yeah, got berries, lemon juice, a little bit of bitters, a uh -huh. uh, little bit of uh, sweetener in there as well. Added the vodka. We uh, muddled up the berries. We're going to shake this really quick. Okay. Look at that. Just such a pro. Okay, so while he's shaking it up, Scott Holcomb, lucky you, get to be the taste tester since you're off camera. You, cho <laughs> you choose which one of the three you would like to choose, and you give us the thumbs up. Would it be the Bloody Mary, the uh, Pigs in a Blanket, or what, what did you call it? We didn't add the vodka. Oh, you forgot the vodka. I got, Money I got so caught up with you smelling it and uh, enjoying yeah. that. You gonna, which one are you going to choose? He, okay, go for it. All right. Holcomb, you going to try that off camera. There you go. And it's oh, in. What's that over there? <laughs> <laughs> if the camera's a little shaky, yeah. it's the lesser of three evils. <laughs> Was that a thumbs up or a thumbs down? <laughs> oh, oh no. not so much. I thought that would be great. Oh. You're really nice. this, this might be good after several beverages. Anywho, thank you so much, <laughs> mixologist extraordinaire Chris Tucker, for trying so hard with us with the bacon vodka. Yay, I know. And you know, Scott <laughs> Holcomb does use I'll just stick to tonight. regular bacon. <laughs> regular bacon on a plate. With right. yeah. She, just she made could me pass try it up on having it in the salad. Apples. She could have I it did. In drink. And I noticed that they're, they're gone. There's one left. We were yeah. kind of bogarting those when you <laughs> yeah. took your Are they break. good? Yeah, they're awesome. And you know, there's only one left, but then when it's empty, you can smell the bag and it smells delicious. I love the smell of green apple.
Mmm, tasty stuff. All right, you've uh, got your big old radio show at noon yeah, today it's 12 on KTK. Noon on KTK, what's happening today on the show? Well, I'll tell you what, Doug the Car Czar is going to be joining me on oh, the show really? today. That'll be an interesting all program. things Car Czar. Mm. And Cody, you mentioned Captain Crunch. Sometime on your weekend show, mm. you should have me come in and make my fried chicken in a Captain Crunch bed, bread, bread, breading. It's oh my awesome. God. Awesome. You fascinate. And it's, <laughs> and it's good for you. Good for you. Have your chef. Have your chef. We'll see you tomorrow morning. You got to see oh, you guys in the morning. Aloha, buddy. Our truck tracker has dispatched himself to the opening of the new Goodwill store.